but we're actually looking at a really nice forecast today. Whatever you got going on, if you're getting ready about to head out to work, about to walk the dog, or just go for a jog, we're looking really nice. It feels fantastic outside. The humidity is still manageable, but as we go through the afternoon, we're looking at the humidity slowly creeping up on us and it's gonna return in full force as we head into the upcoming work week. So here's a look at the satellite and radar imagery. I zoom things out so you can see what's going on. We really don't have any big weather systems heading our way. We have a cold front way out to our north and west, air of high pressure moving away from the Carolinas, but it is going to impact our winds, the direction of the winds. We are dealing with easterly winds right now, not as strong as yesterday, but the east coast sea breeze is going to collide with that west coast sea breeze later on today with that daytime heating showers are actually in the forecast today but we're looking at a nice start to our sunday morning here's your winds we're looking at eight miles per hour in cocoa beach 10 miles per hour in melbourne and also seven miles per hour in new smyrna beach temperatures feeling fantastic we're looking at lower 70s in orlando 71 in kissimmee 78 in melbourne and Cape Canaveral coming in at 66. Here's a look at your outdoor door forecast featuring our pet of the hour. This is Dixie, what a cute dog. This was sent in by one of our viewers, Brianna L. And again, sending your pictures to us, we will showcase, especially me, I love showing your pets because I don't have any pets. And so I love to showca showcase your pets. But yeah, cute little boy there. We are a girl and we are looking at our comfortable conditions kicking off the morning. We will see partly cloudy skies. So more clouds than yesterday. So we'll help with the heat, getting warmer by one in the lower 80s. And here's where we're heading. 91 degrees in Orlando, 90 in Kissimmee, and 89 in Sanford. Deland seeing a daytime high of 88. Coastal communities a little bit cooler, 84 in New Smyrna Beach and 84 in Daytona Beach if you are planning a beach day. Now, drought conditions, we are still dealing with dry conditions across central Florida, especially south and east of the I-4 corridor. So because of that setup, now winds won't be as strong as yesterday. We are still dealing with sensitive fire conditions. So no burning today, and I'm pretty sure that will continue through the week. So rain chances between 30 to 40 inland, lower rain chances along our coast. But as we time things out, here's future radar, partly cloudy skies. And look at this, a few isolated showers out west, staying south of Ocala around the 2, 3 o'clock hour. We get that daytime heating. We'll continue to see showers bubbling up across the area. And some downpours are certainly possible in Lake County and extending into Osceola County. Might see a straight shower near the Orlando area. And then tonight, looking nice. It'll be nice and dry as we head into that time frame. Here's a look at your seven day getting you results. 91 today, 92 tomorrow. Rain chance is low to moderate through the week and we certainly need it, but it is going to get hot. We're in the middle 90s by Wednesday, upper 90s Thursday, Friday and Saturday.